Kim Kardashian made a surprise appearance on her sister Close show Revenge Body Show on Sunday to help a wannabe blogger who called her God. The premiere of the second season of Revenge Body with Khloe Kardashian saw the reality TV star helping two new candidates get their ideal body, including Ken, a homeless man who pretended online to be a glamorous high-end fashion blogger, as well as the usual strict dieting and intense workouts. Ken admitted to stressing out about desires to have his blog ready to make a big impact when he was finally ready for his weight loss reveal on the show. So Chloe got sister Kim, 37, and family friend Jonathan Chevin, 43, to surprise him, with Ken so shocked he initially ran away screaming at seeing them. I walked in and I turned the corner. And I literally saw God, Ken said excitedly of the moment he saw her. God just walked in the building. Ken then explained how he used his online profile to pretend he was living a life he never had in a bid to hide the pain he suffered from losing his mother after having also lost his dad when he was a toddler. Kim advised him to use his pain, telling him, why don't you just flip it and use that energy of what you've been through to show your moods, to show your personality? That's the one thing that Klo taught me too, be authentic, Ken agreed. Kim insisted, what you put out you'll get in return. All these blessings are coming to you and hopefully now you can share your story and inspire other people. Take advantage of it all. Chloe earlier also opened up to Ken when he admitted that most of his problems had started from losing his mother, telling him, I lost my father, and I can't imagine going through that without a support system of someone who understands what you're going through. Ken had admitted he was the biggest bullser this world has ever seen by pretending he was a high-end fashion blogger when he was actually living out of hotels and eating fast food junk. He admitted his photos were almost always taken in stores when he tried on fashion labels he could never afford, and got tearful when he spoke about ending up in jail for writing bad checks. Everyone loves a good comeback story, Klo told him. And we have to own the wrongs we've made in our life to make them right. Ken was initially scared at seeing celebrity trainer Corey Calliott's boxing workout. He ran away only for Corey to eventually invite Ken to stay at his apartment after opening up about his own experiences at losing his mother at age four. Our story is almost identical, bro, Corey told Ken. Ken after his reveal praised his trainer. Corey is like family to me at this point. Corey is like the father and big brother I never had. I feel like everyone I've connected with in this process is going to be a part of my life forever, Ken said. Ken lost 40 pounds and had a blog launch along with this reveal, saying afterward, I think tonight when I go to bed I'm going to remember most that I'm loved. And that's without. That's without the lies. I'm loved and I'm happy. Klo also opened up to weight loss hopeful, Melody, who said her biggest pain was her mother's passive-aggressive criticism about her weight leaving her feeling like she disappointed her. I'm a huge believer of it's not what you say, it's how you say it, Klo told her. For a long time I was told, Klo, you've got to lose weight because you're really hurting the brand. I understood that was coming from my management side of my family, but it does hurt. 
I totally get how you feel, she admitted. Klo also led on to a personal paranoia when she helped celebrity skincare expert nurse Jamie treat Melody, telling her that her lines on her neck were from side sleeping. My biggest problem? Klo complained I hate the lines in my neck. I'm always like, how am I this old? And she's like, you're.